Hello and welcome to the New York Sports Show. I'm your host, Dominic Honweski. Folks, Yankees win it big time again last night. Oh my gosh. That is just an amazing performance for the Yankees. I've been doing seven game winning streak now. They've had a win for the last week straight. Let's keep this up tonight as they continue to go up against the Blue Jays in this series. You know what? I'm going to make a really bored, but who knows? Maybe it's not prediction. I think the Yankees could win this game 17-5 to or at least score more than 12 runs because they've been on fire, honestly. And the Blue Jays have a very, very good team this year. So you can't even say that the Blue Jays aren't a good team. They have a playoff team who could probably go pretty deep in the playoffs as well with the Yankees. So it's not like we're playing up against the the Kansas City Royals or any team like that. So going on in Yankees news, Miguel and Duhar's agent is furious. He believes that there's more behind the demotion in the Yankees organization. Personally, I don't think there's more to it. Miguel and Duhar, he has not had the season that everyone expected him to have, and there's only so much in the ML. Be roster. There's just no room for him with the uh, level of play that he's been producing. Hasn't really done much this season. I support him being sent down. I don't think that there's any more to it than just lack of performance, to be honest with you. I think Miguel Andujar is just that one player who has one good season and then it's just gone, to be honest. Who knows? Maybe he could make things better. It's really hard to say, to be honest with you guys, but I really do not think that there's any more to it. Going on back to that game from last night, Kyle, Kyle Higashioka, or Higashioka, oh my god. It seems like every time this guy hits the ball, it's a home run. Like, honestly, it does seem that way as he hits three, not one, not two, but three Home runs in last night's game. That is, the, he is the third Yankee in franchise history to ever hit three home runs in a game as a catcher. As honestly, this guy is a home run hitting guy. This guy doesn't hit base hits. He doesn't hit doubles. He doesn't hit triples. He hits the long ball out of the park, out of the stadium. Goodbye. See ya. It's out of here. Kyle Higashioka. He he does. He hits bombs. He hits bombs. And Gary Sanchez has competition. I think we all know that Sanchez has been getting uh, still up and down. But honestly, horrible, 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 horrible 2020 season for Gary Sanchez. I feel like Kyle Higashioka may be the, who knows, starting catcher on the starting lineup for the 2021 opener. Who knows? Sanchez has to get his stuff together. But you know what? I would not mind seeing Kyle Higashioka replace him. As much as I love Sanchez, Higashioka has his things together, at least for right now. Comment down below if you guys saw this game. I will be ca I'll recapping tonight's game. Hopefully Yankees win. I think they will. But who knows? Thank you guys for watching this video. I'm your host, Sound of Kind of Rescue of the New York Sports Show. I'm signing out.